So, you decide that it's time to level up your game and take Rocket League seriously. Good, because today I'm going to show you how to learn the 5 mechanics you're going to need to reach the top of the ranks. From half flips and wave dashes to mastering speed flips, this video is going to be your key to success. So buckle up your seatbelts, get comfy and let's dive straight into the mechanics. Starting off with the basics, half flips and wave dashes. Half flips and wave dashes are by far the most used mechanics in Rocket League, simply because they're so easy to do. They're used during kickoffs, recoveries and even on the wall, and if you're like me, you may have even have stumbled across these mechanics by accident in your early days of Rocket League. But if not, here's a quick tutorial of how to do them. For half flips, back flip and immediately flick your joystick up to cancel your flip. Then air roll left or right and for wave dashes simply jump and angle your car slightly up then as your rear wheels land back onto the ground flip forward this is essentially glitching your car to the map allowing for a speed boost next is neutral jumps now i know some of you might be thinking that this is an unnecessary mechanic to learn but trust me it is this is a rather new mechanic for the Rocket League community with 90% of players below Grand Champ still not using it. The neutral jump simply put is when you utilize your second jump without flipping in a direction to reach the ground quicker. In most cases it's going to be the fastest way to recover off the wall or the ceiling. To do a neutral jump start by jumping off the wall and rotating your wheels towards the ceiling. Then, return your joystick back to the neutral position and you use your second jump. Finally, rotate your wheels back towards the ground so that you can land on your wheels and continue recovering back towards your own goal. Number 4. Fast Aerials Fast Aerials are in my experience the most fundamental mechanic to increase in not only your air speed but your air mechanics. Here's how to do them. Step 1 is to pull back on your joystick and boost before you jump because the difference between a fast aerial and a normal aerial is that you boost and then jump rather than jumping and then boosting. Step 2 is to press your second jump while still holding boost so that throughout the entire aerial you're gaining momentum and height. And finally, step 3 which isn't necessary to fast aerial in but does make them faster hold your jump button down on your first jump. The reason you want to do this is that it actually extends your second jump timer and you gain more height for holding your first jump. Final mechanic today, speed flips. Speed flips, without a doubt, have become the most popular flip over the past few years. When Musty discovered them in October of 2019, they revolutionized kickoffs and recovery mechanics forever. So here's an easy tutorial for you to learn them. Step 1, Diagonal Flip, aiming for 11 o'clock on your joystick or 1 o'clock if you flip into the right. Step 2, Flip Cancel. To flip cancel, pull back on your joystick immediately after starting the diagonal flip. Step 3 is to add your air roll and boost to the flip. To do this, hold boost and air roll before starting the flip and keep holding them until completing the flip. Also, you will want to be power sliding when you land so that your car keeps moving in the direction that you want it to. And that's going to be it for these five mechanics today. Please let me know what you guys thought in the comments below and I hope you all have a great day. Oh yeah, and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.